Guys, welcome back it's to my channel, experience. Fusion Food. Beautiful. Big up on the damn self. Cooking is a vibe. Today, this is going to be part one of my lobster series. All right. Now, in this bowl, I'll be adding some flour here. And guys, I'm frying some lobster. But as usual, Fusion Food will always have a twist. I'm adding a cup of flour. Now we're gonna add a teaspoon of baking powder. I'm gonna add some black pepper to this. And I'm gonna add a little bit of onion powder. Some onion powder here. And you can make each of these like a teaspoon. And finally, I'm going to add a little bit of fish seasoning to this. Just want to save this side of this bowl. So, guys, I have my lobster here that I've just finished cut, but I have not cleaned them out as yet. So, now we're going to clean them out. All right, water, water the, the head of the lobster. All right, just want to wash out all these things here. Just want to wash them out. All right. After throwing off that water, just want to give them a second rinse just to ensure that you know you wash off all the impurities. And it, you can look for the gut down here, all right? You can look for the gut here. If you see the gut in here, you just pull it out, all right? And uh, you don't want to eat that part, it just have, has a bitter taste to it. You want your water to be clean and nice like this, all right? Now we're going to throw off this water. We're gonna dry our lobsters. Right. Now I'm about to just take a, a few sheet of napkins and just dry the lobster like this. I'm gonna dry off any excess water here. I'll be seasoning my lobster and before I start the seasoning process I'm just gonna add a little bit of salt just sprinkle a little bit of salt um, in this basin here okay I'll be using one of my most favorite seasoning I'm using recently Tufina's natural spice blend I'm gonna add a little bit of this onto my lobster tail here all right so for each one I'm gonna take out a half teaspoon and I'm gonna just put it in there like that and I'm gonna wrap up this this beautiful of this beautiful seasoning Tofina's natural spice blend I'm gonna rub some on each tail remember guys this is the original one they also have the jerk spicy so remember guys give them a check out to feed and season and go on with a bag of things over here. So each of them I'm putting about half teaspoon of this beautiful spice blend. Just just massaging it into it. Right. Guys, my lobsters are all seasoned now. So guys, I have my frying pan here. Now I'm going to add some oil to this. Some escalion and thyme all rolled up like this. Just to add some flavor to my oil. You know, and it takes a longer time to burn. I also have some crushed garlic. You can see my garlic is a little bit crushed. I'm going to throw it in here just like that. Just to add some flavor to the oil. 
have some more crushed garlic here. Can you see? The crack. Have another garlic here. And I also have a scotch bunny pepper. I made some cut into this scotch bunny pepper, as you can see here. But I've left it like this. I'm also gonna add a few pimento berries to this oil. Right. Now, we're gonna just make the oil one flavor up. I'm going to make the oil one flavor up. Use the wood spoon. I'm getting a beautiful, beautiful aroma from this oil. The oil alone makes it smell like stuck in there, cook already. So much flavor, alright? So you want to flavor your oil, guys. I have my lobster here. And I have my flour here. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take take one of my lobster, and I'm gonna just sprinkle some flour on the inside here, my seasoned flour. Piece of lobster like this. Put some flour on the lobster like that. And this just adds an extra layer of protection with lobster meat as well as you know just give it a little bit of crunch to the meat all right just like that so guys we're about to add our lobster to this oil it's hot and it's ready so I'm gonna turn my lobster meat down just like that. Another one. Turn it down like that as well. I'm just gonna take up these and just drop them on top here. Just so I can put another lobster tail. Okay. So guys, all my lobster is in here now. I'm gonna fry each side of this lobster for about 10 to 15 minutes on medium heat. You know, this still has a little bit of green left in there so you can just let it stay in the pot. If you see it, if you see all of it becomes brown like this then you can just take it out because that means you know all the flavor has been taken out of it already but since there's a little bit in there and if you see any burn um, garlic you can either take it out or turn it on the other side to continue taking out the flavor out of it alright so we're gonna let these lobster just oh guys it's been about eight eight minutes or so now I'm just gonna turn my first lobster. All right, guys. So I just turned all my lobsters. They're coming on very nicely. You can just see. Look at that, man. Look at those meat. Wow. My lobster is done. It has been about 25 minutes now. And these are ready to be taken off the fire. Now guys, with this, I will be serving a sweet and sour spicy sauce. Fried lobster is done. Now we're just gonna add a little bit of our sauce to this, to this beautiful lobster here. Wow, fry lobster, maverick style, like, subscribe, share them on.
fry lobster.